Great speech, Marco. Thank you, sir. Derek Rollins. Judith Thompson. Is Cole's mom here? Can you see her? Cole Thornhart. I'm really proud of you. I wish your dad were here to see you. Yeah, me too. But it's not like I graduated or anything. No, you did graduate. You just need a couple more credits. You showed up. Yeah. That's what counts. <laughs> There's a party at my house by the pool. If you guys want to come by, you're welcome. Hey, um, can, uh, can Langston drive you over there? Uh, aren't you coming? Yeah, later. I just, um, need to clear my head. Are you okay? Yeah, I, uh, I just need a minute. I'll be fine. Anyway, thanks for coming. I'll see you later. Congratulations. Thanks. Because you stop using doesn't mean you stop feeling. He had a tough day today, but he's got to learn to handle the tough days. You're going to lose to my heart somersaults when I swing open the door. You teeter between your crib and the floor, your hair full of static, a new tooth piercing your smile. You unfold your arms like wings and you try to fly. You fall onto a pile of stuffed bears and toy kings. I run to you, expecting your cry. Instead, you rise from the tumble, your tiny sharp fingers clutching my shin. Hand over hand, back to your runway, you stumble. Try to defy gravity again and again. Someday I'll have flown this world, maybe wearing wings of my own. But probably not. My heart was somersault, afraid to see you up so high. But then I'll remember the courage of a child who knows he can't fly, that never stops trying. And then I'll remember the strength of your hands, the knuckles whitening, the fierce way you always, always rise from the tumble. When your grandfather can write. Hey. What, I thought you were going to the graduation. Michael, I need to tell you something.
Get it? I don't got no seat. It's cold. Got a rain star. Hey. Could you check me to the pool? Langston and Marco already headed out back. I'll get that. It's probably him. Okay. You like barbecue? Lead the way. I'll see you later, sir. Okay. 